Hi everyone, Jane here. It's September 4th, 2011. I'm making a quick update video on my dragon fruit and my mame sapote. Um, I uploaded a video on September 1st of me eating, um, tasting these fruits for the very first time. It was pretty interesting. They're um, interesting looking fruits. Uh, if you've never seen or you don't know what dragon fruit is and if you don't know what a mame sapote is, I encourage you to go ahead and watch that video. So these are my dragon fruits that I planted from seeds. I wanted to show these to you because I was very surprised to come out to my patio to see these things already sprouted. Um, also yes, this is a video response to my two dragon fruit buddies, Four Green Earth 2 and Garden Newbie who are also growing dragon fruit from seeds. But um, yes, it's, I planted these August 31st and right now it's what, September 4th, four days later and mine has already germinated. There's one right there, and there's a small one over there, and if you can see it, it still has the seed coating on it, so it's still just co barely coming out. And this one right here is already, you know, removed that seed coating, so I'm very happy and surprised to see mine sprouted four days later. Um, there's more seeds in there, but, you know, I'm sure those will take longer to sprout, but I'm just really happy, and I really want to show those to you, that mine has already sprouted. This right here is my mame sapote. I did searches on YouTube to see how to grow it and no luck. No one seems to be growing these things. I've only seen fully grown mature mame sapote trees. Um, so I didn't know how to really grow this thing. So what I did is I soaked it in water for 24 hours and I dumped half of that water out and it's been like that. So and um, it, it's growing because look at that. Something's coming out of there. I don't know if it's going to be the roots, the stem, the leaves. I really don't know. Like I said, I haven't seen a video of people growing these things. So, my experiment, and it looks like it's doing an amazing job. So, we'll see how it goes. I definitely will make update on this because this, you know, one seed is enough, so I'm really happy this one is growing for me because, you know, they're not, they're not really cheap fruits. Exotic fruits are not cheap, so. But, um, that is that, and also I, uh, I saved some of my dragon fruit seeds on a Ziploc bag. I don't know why, I just kind of, you know, shame to throw all those away. So, I just want to share that with you. And thanks for watching, everyone. Bye.